Hi, I'm Dr. Andrew Jordan, rheumatologist at BJC Health in Sydney, Australia. Today I want to talk about a medication that rheumatologists use called leflunamide, uh, which has, goes by a brand name of Arava commonly. This medication is used in rheumatoid arthritis and psoriatic arthritis as the main uh, indications. It comes in two different doses. 10 milligrams and 20 milligrams. Typically, we will use leflunamide after we've used methotrexate, but sometimes it will be first line treatment in some situations. Uh, it's a tablet that is taken every day. Uh, one of the more uh, common side effects, which can happen uh, in about one in five people, is an upset tummy or diarrhea. This is commonly related to the dose, so it's much more common on the 20 milligrams than the 10 milligrams. Uh, I will typically start at the 10 milligram uh, to test it out, but sometimes you can start at the higher dose. The medication does take a couple of months to be effective, and that's really important to know that you're not going to get immediate results. It works by uh, adjusting your immune system, so there is a slightly increased rate of infections, um, more commonly uh, upper respiratory tract infections. In terms of monitoring, uh, your doctor will usually order some blood tests. The frequency of this will depend, change a little bit uh, depending on the treating doctor, but it may be monthly at the start, and if they're good, they may increase to three monthly. Uh, what your doctor's looking for there is uh, um, particularly a change in the liver function test. This is usually not uh, dangerous, it just means we need to adjust the dose, and sometimes we'll just need to monitor it if it's only up a little bit. Um, occasionally it can um, alter your full blood count and this will also be monitored and frequently your doctor will also be checking your inflammation markers called your CRP and your ESR and these are used to give some guide as to whether the medication is working or not. Uh, there are of course other uh, rarer problems with these medications uh, and you should certainly have this conversation with your uh, treating doctor about what these uh, could be, but they're generally very uh, uncommon. Uh, it is a useful medication. I use it uh, quite a lot in treating rheumatoid arthritis and psoriatic arthritis, and uh, I hope that's helped in uh, answering some of your basic questions about this medication.